Welcome to Math with Mr. J. In this video, I'm going to cover how to square a number. Now, simply put, when we square a number, we multiply a number by itself. When we see an exponent of 2, that means we are squaring a number. Let's jump into our examples and see exactly what this looks like. Starting with number 1, where we have 3 squared. Now, when working with exponents, the bigger number to the left is called the base. The smaller number to the right is called the exponent. The exponent tells us how many times to expand the base out and multiply. Let me rewrite this here. So 3 squared equals, well, this means 3 times 3. The base of 3 expanded out 2 times. So we are multiplying that number by itself, 3 times 3. And we know that 3 times 3 equals 9. 3 squared equals 9. And it's as simple as that. Now a common mistake would be to do 3 times 2. Don't multiply the base by the exponent. That would give us 6, which is incorrect. Remember, expand the base out however many times the exponent tells you. Before I move on to number two, I do want to mention why we call it squaring a number. If we take a look at a square, we can see why we call it squaring a number. For example, if we have a square with side lengths of three, we can find the area of that square by doing 3 squared, or 3 times 3. So 3 by 3. That gives us an area of 9. We can square a side length to find the area of a square. So you can see the relationship between squaring a number and the area of a square. Let's move on to number two, where we have eight squared. Now eight squared, that means eight times eight. So eight squared equals eight times eight. The base of eight expanded out two times. Eight times eight equals 64. So eight squared equals 64. So there you have it. There's how to square a number. Multiply the number by itself. You're expanding that number out twice and multiplying. I hope that helped. Thanks so much for watching. Until next time, peace.